I'm really happy I put this course together and I'm even more happy that you decided to be part of this course. So thank you for this and I'm going to make sure you're not going to regret that. As always, I have to tell you a few words about me because we don't want to be enemies. We will be friends over here. My name is Marcin. I'm Photoshop educator and photo retoucher internationally published in fashion and beauty magazines. I'm well known for my educational career among the web. I have over 5 million views on YouTube, so I believe we can trust each other. Also, I have a lot of premium content on the web with my retouching courses. And this is the course I'm especially proud of uh, because let's answer the question, what is color? When we think of it, it's really difficult to give an answer. How you can describe the red in the words by not using any colors? You will say strong, but you need to name the color to really describe it. So once again, what's the color? To me, the way to express that, we cannot really explain that. We feel color. We look at the color and it makes us feel a certain way. We look at red and we know it's strong. We know maybe it represents love. Maybe it represents some other strong emotions. When we look at soft blue, we feel calm. So color is emotion and colors make us feel a certain way. In this course, I want to practice with you practical use of color how we see color, how to build a drama on the image using colors, on different examples. Because it's very important for the image to stand out. And without the color grading, you cannot really achieve sometimes uh, the results you, you really want. The colors make your image stand out. The colors are most important part of the image. In this course, we're going to walk through a different example. At first, we're going to take a look in probably most popular kind of photography in the last few years. So something for photographers. If you are a photographer, you should really enjoy that. We are taking as an example, outdoor image, natural light. And I'm going to show you at first how to clean this image because I believe maybe not everyone knows that and then I will show you how to do right color grading, what's important to know about outdoor images, what's the thing that make outdoor image good looking and how to understand the color on certain image and how to apply the color. In the next part, we're going to jump into studio photography, something more commercial, so if you are a commercial photographer or retoucher, that should be something for you. I'm going to show you how to work with color, how to push up what's the best from colors, how to do all of the small fixes and shifts. If you have some color shifts, some color corrections need to be done, I'm going to show you how to do this in simple way, how to do color toning and up to final touches, how to achieve the perfect color, everything we do separately for shadows, highlights, and mid-tones. At the end, I'm going to jump into more creative area. I have this amazing set from my fellow uh, partner in crime, photographer Zuzia Zavada. I love to work with her. We did a lot of work and we have this one set that was actually published in No Name magazine. And I'm taking this as an example because it was great color work. I had a lot of fun working with the colors because it was something unusual. It wasn't really commercial work, but it was something that could let your creativity go. So I'm, to go, I'm going to show you how you can work creatively with colors, how you can approach your color work in an unusual way to achieve really amazing results. So no matter what you are doing, you will find something for yourself in this course. So right now, I believe we can jump in the first lessons. I'm going to tell you a few more words about the images. And remember, if you have any questions about this course, about the images, or just about being 
retoucher itself, feel free to leave me the question. I'm going to see you in the next lesson.